Um, apa kabar? Ketemu lagi di live Instagram Listen to Kimi FM di mana pada kesempatan hari ini kita akan ketemu sama Artist of the Month Listen to Kimi FM di bulan Maret dan this March we have Artist of the Month coming from Chicago USA. We're gonna talk about anything, especially her music, her career and also her new song Paradise. So we're gonna live Instagram with Asia, the independent musician, the independent artist from Chicago. USA. So, buat kamu yang sudah bergabung dari Indonesia, saya ucapkan selamat malam dan untuk teman-teman yang ada di luar Indonesia, especially in USA, good morning there. So, I'm gonna live with your artist in your artist, especially from Chicago, Asia and Asia is going right now. Yeah, has joined with me right now. So, I'm gonna inviting her right now. Hopefully, this. Uh, we have connection, yeah, trouble, always. Hi. Hi, hello, Asia. I see my face. Ah, there we go. <laughs> good morning, Chicago. Good morning, or good evening in Indonesia. Hello. <laughs> yeah, it's 10 p.m. here and 10 a.m. at your time, correct? Okay, how are you doing Asia, by the way? I'm doing well, I'm doing very well. It is, you know, for a cold day here in Chicago, it's crazy. It was just like super warm, now it's cold, so mm -hmm. I'm good. Really you. super warm? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so, uh, I, okay, first thing first, I really like to see you, yeah, and then I love your hair, yeah, your Thank your hair so cute, and it's like, oh, you're, you're very, very amazing to join with my show right now, and oh, please, first thing first, yeah, we already know you are the single uh, independent artist from Chicago, USA, but let's introduce yourself first to our audience, especially for audience listen to Kimi FM in Indonesia, okay, here we go. Well Hello everyone in Indonesia. My name is Asia. Mm -hmm. I am an artist but stateside. Um mm -hmm. based out of Chicago. So I sing R and B. Um yeah. So hello. <laughs> Wow, okay, for the first, I saw uh, your music, like, Paradise, it's like, I feel like you're gonna be the next top star at R&B music. I wish, yeah, and it's very, uh, uh, you know, like, happy and glad having you on my show, Asia, honestly. Oh. And I wanna know, what you're doing lately, by the way? Oh my gosh, what am I doing lately? Oh, I mm -hmm. feel like as of recent, I have been working on, you know, we just released Paradise. So we're just constantly working mm -hmm. on brand new music and, you know, exercising, mm -hmm. trying to make sure my mental health is good. So just really keep mm -hmm. it up with self because um, you, you do get caught up in the, you know, mm -hmm. the everyday and you forget about mm -hmm. taking care of yourself. So that's pretty much been a, a huge point for me. So yeah. Thank you for having mm. me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why uh, it's very difficult time, yeah. During this pandemic, we have to, you know, taking care of our mental health, mm -hmm. right? Yes. So, so we have to know Asia as independent musician, independent artist, yeah. Where uh, do you starting your music? Because uh, uh, we already know you're living in Chicago. You was born in Chicago, or where? Where do you come from? Can you tell us? The state, so um, everything. I am based out of Chicago. I am from Chicago. Mm -hmm. So everything Chicago here. <laughs> but um, Okay. Yeah. Yep, that's pretty much where I started my music. Um, how I got my start, mm -hmm. I would, you know, mm -hmm. I sang in church. And um, mm -hmm. I also would sing for other musicians as well, sing back up for them. So the uh, rapper is mm -hmm. locally based in Chicago. Mm-hmm. Mm, okay, so when do you start your music, by the way? And basically, are you, uh, you know, uh, your music like R&B only, or what kind of music so far you made of your career? Mm, that's a good question. It has at this at this moment, my focus has been R&B. So it hasn't been like the traditional sounds, but it's more mm -hmm. um, it's it's neo soul. 
it's contemporary uh -huh. because we're we're trying other elements so some of the stuff that you would find um some of the elements uh -huh. like the the instrumental elements that you find in rap music yeah. you'll also see some of that in in um in my music anything like a good mesh of like rock like i love live guitar like the electric guitar uh -huh. i love it you'll uh -huh. also find that in my music as well so yeah trying different elements just to mix it up Okay, great. So paradise, yeah. Everyone watching us, please watching my background. Here is the Asia uh, new song Paradise, and has published uh, uh, last February, correct? At February, and when I heard your Paradise, I feel like oh, it's gonna be awesome for the next future R&B musician, I guess. So congratulations for your new song, by the way, Asia. Thank you so much. Can you, yeah, can you tell us how uh, the you know the journey from uh, before and after the Paradise song? You write the song by yourself, or I don't know, maybe you had uh, people behind of Paradise. No, that's a good question. So how Paradise was um, what I call a pandemic song. It was one of the songs that I uh, created. Like I created a batch of music. Um, mm -hmm. while in, you know, while we were pretty much locked in because of COVID. And this was one of those songs. Mm -hmm. And so um, I, how I mentally thought about Paradise, it started mm -hmm. from like, um, it, it's based off of like a one night stand. So you think you're just going to go have mm -hmm. some, you know, just some fun, a night of fun. And then it turns into something. Okay. So that's the crux of the story. And then um, okay. I wrote this by my, yep, I wrote it by myself. Um, but it mm -hmm. has gone through several different versions. So um, it went from like a completely stripped, um, like live sounding, like um, mm -hmm. jazz type uh, cabaret type thing. Like it starts out in that, mm -hmm. that um, preface. And then where it's at now, mm -hmm. it's got like some really funk soul elements that we wanted to live and just to liven up the record. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love that song. Oh, when I heard for the first time for the dice, I feel like, yeah, it's very amazing song from Asia, the independent music. And I don't, uh, you know, I, I can uh, believe it, you're an independent musician, you know, because mm -hmm. I feel like the female singer like you, the super powerful voice, yeah, and also the good music has independent. So why? We have to know. Do you pick as an independent? Maybe you have... Uh, I don't know, management before for your music or this is your first time going to uh, globally for your music and being independent musician? So, yeah, um, it's, it's, that's actually, I love your questions. This is, um, it's, it's bigger. You, um, it's bigger than we think, mm -hmm. right? Um, because once mm -hmm. we go to a label, like you're, you're set in yeah. stone and you have, to, you have mm -hmm. to produce what they're asking you to produce. So it's a possibility that mm -hmm. my sound can change, right? So okay. um, at this very moment, I, I enjoy being able to just get the music that I like to produce out. So that means, yes, I'm paying for everything, um, but mm -hmm. it's fine. I'm like, I also work a nine to five. So um, I'm blessed and grateful to be able to pursue this passion and dream so that that can really uh -huh. just be, be the, the sole thing instead of me having to work two different jobs, uh -huh. <laughs> my independent music career and then, you know, my day job. Yeah. So, but yes, um, it, there are pros to being independent because you just, you have uh -huh. a lot more control and say so over yeah. your own career. So it's more freedom. Yeah. There, and, and I do enjoy that. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like you, you know, like being independent artist or being independent podcaster like myself isn't easy, but we have fun to create the content, you know, to create something to to others, yeah, at least our masterpiece is going well and also yes. be good, be kind to another people. Right. Well, anyway... Thank you for joining us, yeah. Uh, welcome to my podcast, Listen to Kimmy FM. As always, every single month, we had an uh, artist of the month for support in the artist of the world. And for this March, we have Asia, the indie artist or independent female uh, musician from Chicago, USA. And for all of you, join us. Thank you for joining and don't go anywhere because we have to move to the quick 
question in Asia, we have to answer quickly. And from this quickly answer, <laughs> okay. yeah, we already know who is Asia. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. Okay, first, you're gonna pick to love or to be loved. Ooh, 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 love. To love? Yes. To love, all right. So, next, you're gonna be uh, with somebody, American man or British man. Ooh. American man. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, America. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So, if you dating, you're gonna pick the mountain or the ocean? Ooh. Um, the mountain. The mountain. Okay. <laughs> Next question is fake relationship or fake friend? Repeat it. One more time. Fake. Okay, fake relationship or fake friend? Ooh, can I say neither? <laughs> I don't want either. Your know. choice. Okay. Yes. <laughs> and it blew me as well. <laughs> <All right. laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, last question is drama or action movie? Ooh. Um, drama. Drama. You yeah. will pick drama movie. Okay. So it, you pick drama. We are a woman. Doesn't mean we are the drama queen, correct? Because we love to watch the drama movie. <laughs> All <That's> right. right. <laughs> okay, everyone. Uh, hi from Indonesia, Kadian, and also Sabrina Brilli. I don't know where are you come from, but thank you for joining us. Yeah. Sabrina's from Chicago. She's actually um she's one oh. of my sorority. She's a part of my sorority. So hi. Oh, hi Sabrina. Welcome uh, to our Instagram live. Yeah, and then Asia. I'm already uh hear your uh, music paradise, but I never find your uh, music before. Yeah, so this okay. is your first uh, single on media digital platform or how. No, it's not. And that's the, thank you for bringing mm -hmm. that up. So my initial artist mm -hmm. name was my actual name, which is Asia Monique. So um, no. my, first, my first, my very first EP um, called mm -hmm. Looking Glass was, um, mm -hmm. was uh, put out in 2015. So it is available on all mm -hmm. major digital streaming platforms, but um, it was recently mm -hmm. brought over to my new name, which is Asia, as you see it now. So, mm -hmm. oh, okay. So it's like you're brand new, uh, you know, branding yourself from Asia Monique to Asia only, correct? That's right. Yes. Okay. By the way, who influences you, Asia? Who influences me? Oh my gosh. Um, I would have to say mm -hmm. just my family, my friends, everything around me. So. Um, mm -hmm. It's not just one benefactor, but it's it's more or less, you know, my experiences and my relationships. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, what happened with your relationship, by the oh, way? No. <laughs> <laughs> not like that, but... Okay. You're so silly. Yeah, no, the, just the, the actual relationship as a whole, like how I'm, like I'm meeting you, like I could write a song about just how this, like how we've interacted mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. some, but some of the songs like you, hi legendary, um, how we um, just interact period, like some of like, some yeah. of my past relationships, you know, I could tell a story about that, no name. Oh, but I could okay. It. So it's not just based off of my, you know, my loving relationships, but it's just the connections that I make. Period. Mm. So, mm -hmm. mm, okay, I see. How many songs you write uh, so far before Paradise? How many oh, songs until okay. today? <laughs> a lot. I, I've, I've How much? Um, I have. Mm -hmm. I have, I've had like four, maybe five notebooks of these in the past couple years. Wow. So it's a mm -hmm. pretty thick notebook. Um, and then I also write okay. um, on, mm -hmm. on my iPad. So I'm always writing mm -hmm. songs. I have a new song mm -hmm. every day. It's just a matter of, you know, making it stick, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Like, 
so I'm constantly writing. Um, I have like, I have like hundreds, hundreds of songs. <laughs> really? I, oh my! Uh, so it's it's a matter though. It's different from like writing the song versus what's actually uh -huh. recorded. So I am still uh -huh, uh -huh. quite a bit of music. <laughs> Oh my god, it's amazing, yeah, because being a, you know, a song writer isn't easy. You you have to, you know, like inspiration from other people and also so many experience to writing something to make a good song, all right? Yeah, it does. It does. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so everyone join us. Thank you once again, DJ Legendary. All right, yeah. Asia. <laughs> Hi, welcome to our live Instagram. And I'm very honored, such honor having you, Asia, as my artist of the month for this March, especially. Yeah, and then you know, Paradise is very easy listening and also lovely song. Okay, so mm. it's gonna be. Also, if you could sing that song, yeah, live on Instagram right now to our right audience, now. yeah, and give us the best performance at our live Instagram for your paradise. Okay. Here. About How about that? Now. Okay, I think I can do that. For okay. You. Okay, everyone. Please welcome. This is Asia, the artist of the band of Lisa to Kim FM this March with the new song Paradise. Let's go. There we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just hate this feeling to love. for Asia, my artist of the month <laughs> from Chicago, USA. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's awesome. Who say, uh, say like, it's very chill. Look at you, yeah, life like this. So how about me? I feel like amazing <laughs> and such other heavy you. And like I said, I have a feeling like Asia is going to be the next stop. Star, I don't know, female singer from independent industry music at USA. I know it's an easy being artist in the USA, you know. So, can you tell us currently, yeah, this uh, 
industry music, especially the independent uh, industry in USA. Can you tell us because you know my podcast is always support independent in uh, indie artists all over the world. But can you tell us to my audience, especially in Indonesia, how you handle the you know the competitor and also your quality music? at your country to be independent musician especially in the artists at Chicago. Sure. Yeah, no, it's it is it is not easy. <laughs> so, um you Okay. Yeah, I'm we're in my home. This is this is my home studio. So this is my home studio. All right. Um, and I'm I playing, can see I'm, that. Yeah, so I was mm. playing right now. I was able to get it to work mm-hmm. after I call earlier. Um, you know, okay. the, the sound setup cuz of where the record was actually playing, but Um, I mm-hmm. actually will sing demos here, and then I will take mm-hmm. it to a studio. So I'll take it to a, a mm-hmm. large studio, record the music here, okay. have it, you know, um, ran by a, a professional engineer, and um, yeah. I also have my executive producer there as well. And then we'll later, okay. you know, mix and master it, which is a completely different process. And then boom, mm-hmm. where I'll get it back, I'll get the final back, and I will put it, you know, I'll, I'll. I'm sorry. I'll upload it onto um, mm-hmm. my distributor site so that we can have it in all the the major places like so Spotify, Apple Music, yeah, um, Amazon Music, uh, Title. Just making sure it's everywhere, anywhere it can be. And um, mm-hmm. yeah, so I'm like, it's just managing that and then making sure that the music, first of all, is everywhere. It's sending a thousand emails yeah. to make sure that you know you get my music and it's you know you want to play it or like. Um, mm-hmm. Another media outlet or a blogger or mm-hmm. influencer wants to get their hands yeah. on I'm like, you know, something that fits their realm, making sure they have it. So mm-hmm. I'm, I am working all different roles as the independent artist. I am my secretary. I am my publicist. <laughs> you know, it. you have to be, yeah. you know, also have to make content to post here. Yeah. So um, there are independent artists that will, of course, hire the publicist. Mm-hmm. Um, Mm-hmm. And making sure that they have that PR and or and or media representation there for assistance, but you know it's you're still your own business is my point. So you're constantly mm-hmm. making sure you're front facing with all of these people, and you also have to network too. Yeah. So I mean, making I'm like, well, now that the world is opening up, being able to go outside and go to some of these, um, you know, like these um, places, performances, anything, just being in these spaces. Yeah, so it's it's a busy time. It's a lot of work, but I love it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why I made this program to support indie artists of for those, especially for you from Chicago, USA. You know, so I've been uh, uh, doing this program almost uh, two years, yeah, one years already, and yeah, I feel like uh, isn't easy to be independent artist because it's you know, yeah, uh, uh, all uh, managed by ourselves, right? Mm-hmm. But if you could say thank you, you will say thanks to who to support your music until today. Ooh, oh my gosh. I have I have a list of people in my brain. So um saying thank you okay. first and foremost, I would say thank you to my family. Um, because mm-hmm. they're they are the ones that actually first of all told me that I could be anything that I wanted, um, and also mm-hmm. help support that, you know, by putting me okay. in, you know. Dance class, music, like just any music classes, mm-hmm. um, playing piano, things of that sort. Being able to really help mm-hmm. build that vision. Also, my my okay. friends that are, of course, my family because we're all in mm-hmm. this together and we'll support each other no matter what we do. And um, yeah. my sorors that are also my family because they've been supported. They're like my day ones, and okay. it's pretty much everybody around, like my entire, just just everyone. Like, so, like, my, my thank yous run deep, <laughs> but, but I would say, I'm thinking everyone, okay. even, like, from here in Chicago and Atlanta, everyone that is actually tuned in and popped into this live that I've seen come through, okay. thank you guys for even coming through to listen, to just kick it with us today, so I really yeah. appreciate it. And because of you guys, yeah, Asia has already published the paradise that was amazing, and paradise is awesome. Okay. Ooh. And how about the video clip, Asia? What's your plan for the next of your paradise, and what's your goals in 2022? Oh my gosh, girl! The goal is to keep going. So. 
Um, remember mm -hmm. I told you, cause I'm like, I know you mentioned earlier that you were not able to find my first project, but that first project came out in 2015 and it's called Looking Glass. It's mm -hmm. available on all of the major DSPs as well. But mm -hmm. between 2015 and 2022, mm -hmm. just, you know, being able mm -hmm. to get that song out that, that that's a long gap. So now that I have mm -hmm. envisioned that sound, oh girl, honey, it is, it's a wrap now. Like being able to just constantly release music from this point. So the next song, okay. is, it's called, the next song is called Rain. We have a title for Rain. It. Rain. Yes. Okay. So it'll be coming out sometime next month. So we're just, we're working through some of the, some of the, um, the technical mm -hmm. stuff on that one. And we should be having that out soon. So you'll see that. But the goal is to constantly just release music at this point. Um, I mm -hmm. have not really settled on when another EP will come out, but you guys are going to be singing some singles, seeing some singles from me all of 2022. It's going to be a bop. It's going to be great. <laughs> so that is really okay. Cool. Yeah. Wow. Okay. So I suggest you, if you were, uh, if you were to make a video clip, especially, I don't know, Paradise or another song of yours, yeah. Mm -hmm. You have to visit my country, Indonesia, because we have a lot of the good, you know, landscape, yeah, the mountain, the ocean, and also the land. It's going to be awesome if you collaborate and visit Indonesia. And for your info, American, yeah, uh, could be free. Visit Indonesia, visa free for this time. Yeah, <laughs> we talk later about that. <laughs> To okay. Bali, yeah, from yeah, from USA to Bali is a free visa for currently. So it's gonna be awesome if you want to make the video clip about I don't know, paradise or an end. So on. Oh my <laughs> Something gosh. like, like that. Kimmy, say less. I'm like, if if I need to come to Indonesia, girl, I will yeah. be there. Okay, I'm gonna sure. be there. I'm gonna figure this out. Thank you. And I'm I'm going to hit you up because I'm going to need you to tell me what the best food places are, like where I need Yeah. To okay. Yeah. My okay. pleasure. <laughs> okay. Well, Asia, I want to know to you, yeah, who do you see yourself as an indie artist? How do I see myself as an indie artist? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. I, how do I see myself as an indie artist? I, If I look at myself... And, and like in anybody else's position, I think I would want to get to know me. Like, I think I'm pretty cool. Mm -hmm. I like, I like my sound. Like, it's fun. It's, it's, mm -hmm. it's easy. It can, it, it's translatable. Um, I'm somebody that you can relate to. Like, you listen to my music and it's just like, you know what? I'm mm -hmm. this. Like, this is something that, mm -hmm. you know, if you're sad, put me on. If you're happy, put me on. If you just want to vibe, okay. put my music on. So how I see myself as an artist i just i think i'm pretty chill mm -hmm. i think I'm, I'm i think i'm amazing i think i'm dope i, I again i'm somebody that mm -hmm. i want to get to know so um yeah and i i love that about me um that is that is my goal so i, I probably mm -hmm. artist asia is is probably just a little bit more like fancy than, than, mm -hmm. than regular <laughs> asia i'm like is he, you got regular like, okay chilly right now because we're at my house but like anywhere out i am just wow ah. Wow, I'm fancy. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's how I see myself, though. Um, okay. Like, yeah, I see myself as somebody who's um, just a visionary, but I'm also really about the business, too. So I like to be able to make sure that everything is handled. We're, like, smooth selling, no questions. So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I I feel like you're independent woman too, yeah. So yeah. it's amazing being a woman. Uh, you can handle all by yourself your music, your life, and also many so, uh, to do. You handle with yourself. Okay, okay, Asia. You know, uh, listen to Kimmy FM. Basically, my podcast is a support system to support single factor out there. You know, like a single person, single life, uh, single mom, single dad, married, mm -hmm. unmarried, something like that. Single factor. We call it a single factor. So, mm -hmm. what do you want to say to our audience, especially the single factor watching us, how to be success and also happy? For the single woman that's out there raising a family, 
for the single woman that is out there wanting to build that family, build that success, do what you need to do because that is what is going to make you happy. First, make sure that you are in a position to where you personally are like, you know what, I can actually take this on. Um, because as a sing like as a single mother, my, my, my mother was a single mother, um, you know, you have you tend to put your family before yourself. And sometimes okay. that'll wear yeah, it'll wear you down. So although you want to make sure that your family's together, don't forget about yourself. Mm -hmm. So if you want to go get that, that that degree while you're raising your babies, go do it. Make just it's it's gonna be hard. You know that. But it is the matter of you putting your passion out there and being successful. So grind, mm -hmm. but don't ever forget about yourself. So you wanna go you wanna go get that degree, you wanna go get that job, mm -hmm. you want to sing, mm -hmm. do it. There's no one stopping you but you. You just got to make the time for it. So I'm encouraging you today, no matter where you're at in life, to take the steps in order for you to get in the position that you want to be in. You got this. Thank you, Asia. Very, you know, kind. And also it's very uh, mean to us, yeah, especially the single moms out there who watching us, also single fighter. Just do it, yeah, and be yourself. That's right. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, it's uh, 30 minutes, yeah. We have live Instagram. It's a very amazing, once again, having you on uh, my program to support India Artists of Part the World, Asia. And before closing, I want to know, how do you know about Indonesia, my lovely country? How do I know about Indonesia? Oh my gosh. Um, I had to look it up on my <laughs> on Google, like just through history books. I just I think it's a stunning yeah. country. Just a stunning mm -hmm. country. So YouTube. It's like, oh my gosh. So yeah, I definitely had to look it up. And I am very much I am very much interested in, in visiting. I would love to. Mm -hmm. I would totally love mm -hmm. to just to immerse myself in the culture. I think you all are beautiful people. And it's a beautiful space. Yeah. So <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, I have to say my country is very lovely country, something like that. And yes. before closing, because uh, my audience in Indonesia watching us either, yeah, so you have to say it's evening time. You could say like, good evening, selamat okay. malam. Can you do that? You asked selamat me malam. Yes. Yeah, good evening in Selamat Indonesia. Malam. It's Selamat Malam. Can you repeat me? Selamat Malam. Selamat Malam. Yeah? Correct. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Selamat Malam. And, Indonesia. Okay, thank you, Asia. And also, thank you in Indonesia. It's Terima Kasih. Terima Kasih? Yeah. Okay. Terima Kasih. Terima, yeah. Terima Kasih. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, you repeat me with well, so I guess you really have to visit my country and bring your music to our audience and make the, you know, the tour, the show, something like that. Hopefully, hopefully the international music uh, in Jakarta or in Indonesia could bring you, yeah, because as you know, Indonesia so far we have a like Java Jazz International Music Festival every year. Yeah, after the pandemic we'll be right back. We'll be back this year. Also the all the and yeah, you know, all the promoter in Indonesia would be support me to bring the indie artists from listen to Kim FM. Just wish me luck and I could bring you someday. <laughs> yes, no, sort like certainly. I will totally come. So yes, just let me know. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah. Okay, once again, what do you want to say to your fans, to your audience, to our audience for listening to music, especially Paradise and your music coming up next? Sure. Well, first, I want to thank you all again for tuning in this well this evening and or this morning, depending on where you are. You all are amazing. Okay. You all are beautiful. And I certainly appreciate the support. For more on my music, um, just I am everywhere on Spotify, on Apple Music, on Tidal, just every single place. So just look me up. If you are on Instagram, as you can see, or anywhere else on Twitter, just everywhere, it is who is Asia, A-S-X-A. 
okay so you can find me anywhere just i promise i will respond to you um i love you guys and thank you again for the support you all are amazing <laughs> I love you too, Asia. Very amazing. Uh, we ha uh, we wish yeah, your music will be, you know, uh, number yeah I don't know number one or number two at top chart someday. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm As in, yeah, hopefully, yeah. Yeah, okay, Asia, once again, thank you very much for your time and join to my show once again. Best luck for you, yeah, and also everyone join us, watching us. Thank you so much, and don't forget to follow Asia at Asia on Instagram, who is Asia, yeah, and also follow her music on all digital platforms, especially Spotify, Apple Music, and so much more, okay? Just follow Instagram at who is Asia too much more about asia once again thank you so much asia good luck and also stay healthy in yes, chicago okay you as well in Jakarta. thank you thank you everyone stay healthy happy weekend asia and everyone see you on next live instagram bye bye, bye.